Shepard, did I help? Yeah, Conrad. You helped. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Effect 3, this is Hill, and we're on the Citadel, and we played Mass Effect in the wrong order. So, I don't know, we just uh, thwarted the Cerberus coup, and I don't know what we can still do, because we've forfeited a lot of missions by uh, doing that mission. But let me, um, let's head up to the Spectre office for a moment. So here we have Udina's office, who's now dead. And it has been locked. You know, it would really have been cool. This this is one of the, the sticking points that I have with Mass Effect 3 in this Spectre office. How there are no other Spectres. I mean, this is the hub of the galaxy. Now, there, there would have to be other Spectres. And at the very least, why isn't Ashley in here? This would have been a great place for them to meet up. Okay, I'm through. Okay, Spectre Terminal. Wow, we've got nothing new? Spectre Requisitions. Some Greaves. Power Recharge Speed might be nice, but I, I like my armor that I've got now. I might keep that for the rest of the game. Alright, we're leaving. Nothing here, no one to see. might uh, notice some stutters and stuff. This particular area is very hard on any PC, unless you've got like a really powerful top-of-the-line thing. Maybe it can handle all this. All right. Oh, we have all these options. Let's go to Purgatory. So this particular episode, we will probably just spend it uh, on the Citadel and see what side missions are left. Uh, this is really amazing how we have all these female Turians. Wow, so now it's a Krogan that was knocked out? I think there was... Most of these people were... Um, humans and now we have all these aliens I like it project variety people project variety okay let's hope my PC can handle all this oh and look who it is Ugh, this sucks what have you got there Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They've got us spread out across Alliance units. Reinforcing barriers, modding ammo, that kind of thing. How are they holding up? They are fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave. <laughs> you look good. Complain if you like, but I think military life suits you. Hey, running back to the Alliance was your lifelong dream, not mine. Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board. And people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah. Maybe your little suicide squad taught me something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. My guys are handling the support stuff well. Still see some action, but they're not on the front lines. They've saved a lot of lives. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights. But the little shits are useless without me. I gotta stick with them. 
Because I'm dependable now, apparently. <laughs> I blame you for this, Shepard. Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. Oh, boy. Dancing. <laughs> Shepard, everybody knows you can't dance. technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. Oh, Edie, you are just so full of jokes. Okay. Um. Don't think there's anybody else up here to talk to. Can we get a drink? I thought there was a a, a drink uh, option here. Well, look at this bartender. All right now. That's right. Dance like this is the end of the the world of the galaxy, because it is. Okay, let's. Uh, um, we're gonna work the right side of the bar first before we do anything else. Aha! Uh -huh. I've been looking for these people. The oh. going gets tough, and my former engineers hit the bar. Shepard, you're alive. I told you, nothing can take down Shepard. We heard about the Reapers attacking Earth, then Cerberus decides to screw you too. I can't believe we work for them. Not anymore. So you're not on the Elusive Band's payroll anymore? After the Alliance locked you up and impounded the Normandy, Cerberus recalled the whole crew. But we slept away. We were there for the Normandy. For you. Nor for them. And there was something creepy about those recall orders. Just didn't feel right. She's got good intuition. Cerberus helped us take down the Collectors. They served their purpose. And now it's time to pay them back, right in their daddy bags. Let us join you, Commander. We'll serve on whatever ship you fly. We want to help. Grab your gear. Normandy's docked at Bay D-24. You've got Normandy back? Fantastic. I missed her. Thank you, Commander. We'll see you on board. Yes, I should have come here sooner. So look at this. We have some little graphical issues. Whoa. Okay. Table dance, anyone? Um, they seem to be holding glasses that are invisible. Okay. Still works, though. Still works. And look at the Turians over here. Oh, it's three females. Okay. They really put in a lot of Turian females. Interesting. Okay, I don't think we can talk to him. And here is Joker. Uh-oh, I think we just got a... Um, maybe not a quest, but just some information. All right, Joker. Look at this. All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war. How is this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. This is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. Hmm. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? Sure, I approve. 
now that she looks human. Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action? That's always a risk. But then so are the Reavers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. Hmm, <laughs> you deserve to be stupid. If you could be out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you've got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay. I guess he uh, is going up to dance with Edie. So, I think I missed out... Look at this. I, was there a Krogan here before? I don't remember. I missed out on James being here and uh, a toast with the Marines, the Alliance Marines. So we've probably missed out on a lot, people, I hate to say, because we went and did the Tachunka mission. And then the Cerberus coup locks out a lot of stuff. But all right, let's come down here and talk so to Arya. So you admit you and your thugs are here illegally? Yes, and it only took C-Sec three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari Consular. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? I'm being asked to submit to immigration processing. Of course you are. Done. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Thank you. My pleasure. I think we're done here. It's like they Enjoy say, the show. it's who you Shut know. Up. I guess there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly uptight. Then why are you here? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my ship list. But you're you alive. For every second I've spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. As I was saying, but you're alive. At least you escaped to fight another day. And that day is coming. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? On Omega. I kept the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force for your war. I've laid the groundwork with all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. <laughs> Those gangs are scum. Give a criminal a gun, he'll shoot you in the back. They already have guns, Shepard. I'll make sure they point them at the Reapers. I'm trying to help you. Why don't you think it over? Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Sun's leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. You obviously don't know Bailey very well. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we're raking up the Paragon. And we got a bunch of journal updates. Is that a quarry over there? I am just so amazed by Project Variety, really. Mod author, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, 
Okay, I think we need to go... What, to the dock area? What is it? Yeah, the holding docks. One moment, please. And I'm not sure we are going to get to see the progression. Because in the, the start of the game, this dock was pretty empty. No. Wait, aren't you Commander Shepard? Solik Vaz, documentary maker. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifices, their moments of bravery. Something holding you back? CSEC won't allow me on the docks. They say I'd be disruptive. But you could catch a few quick shots for me. Yeah, I'm a paragon. I'll help you. Good idea. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. If you could just take a few shots with your Omni-Tool in the refugee camp. I'll be here when you're done. All right. Let's go on in. Yes, we can. Tell your friends to move their ship out of the All right. It's not uh, quite so crowded here. Just let them land. I'll pay. This isn't about money. The words are all... Sure you can't squeeze in a few more people, officer? And who the heck are you? Oh, Commander Shepard. Uh, if that's what you think, I'll, uh, I'll find them soon. So my family can dock? Commander Shepard says your family's cleared. Just tell them to hurry. I... Thank you, Commander. Thank you so much. It's no problem. I don't remember this group of people standing here. No replacement has been selected for the position vacated. Look, a Krogan. Oh, a photo opportunity. I can't really use that. Could you try again, please? Oh, okay. Being picky, aren't we? Um, excuse me. Okay, I gotta go this way. How about here? Yes, that's just what this documentary needs. And look at these interspecies relations. I'm a human being comforted by a Solarian. Okay, you know I'm tripping, people. I am tripping off of Project Variety. I really am. Because this, this area, the Citadel used to be so human-centric. And now we've got, you know, I think the the appropriate amount of aliens. I think we might need a different subject. I like those guns. I need to remember to do some upgrades on the guns. All right, quarians. I don't think quarians were here. All right, we have to work every inch of. Uh, this area because there's so much going on down here in these docks okay so this we can buy stuff here um, we got enough money let's buy a the terminus armor Yeah, I think this, this is good enough for now. And who are you? Okay, this is a mission for another time, I think. What are you doing here? I'm waiting. Waiting? Waiting for who? Oh, for my parents. They put me on the rescue transport and said to wait for them here. Mm -hmm. Yep. This is realistic to have people sleeping. Whatever happened to this nice lady who was helping everybody out? Uh -oh, look at her on the floor. Kelly Chambers? Yeah, that's her. She's dead. What? Yeah. What? When Cerberus took the docks, they walked right up to her and asked, Are you Kelly Chambers? Oh, no. She said yes, and they 
after bullet right between your eyes. Oh my goodness. Whoa. I guess if Cerberus asks if you're such and such, the correct answer is no. All right, so Kelly Chambers is dead, people. Wow. See, this is what happens when, when you don't do these missions in the right order. All right, here's another photo. This is what happens. This is a shame. I really wanted to see her again. Because in my, my personal playthrough, unfortunately, she didn't survive. She died at the... Uh, the Reaper base. I need support. Someone sabotaged the metagel dispensers, and I've got some idiot preaching about Cerberus down here. No, I've contacted CSEC. They said it's not a priority and it doesn't matter. What matters is that I've got Turian soldiers dying for lack of medication. Actually, it was the Collector base that she uh, died. She was captured by the Collectors. So, yeah. You know, get, getting a perfect playthrough of Mass Effect is, is quite a challenge. Alright, so we actually have two... Ooh, what's the... A photo up. Wow, this guy is really um, picky about the photos. Alright, so we got James down here. Really? People playing cards? Alright, so we've completed that. James? Hey, Commander. James? Enjoying yourself? Yeah, yeah. Try not to lose everything. Those clothes are a line's property. Oh. I have a little faith, loco. I have a little. <laughs> Alright. So we have a lot of Asari over here. Uh oh, Darner Vosk. Who is he? Wow, Arya wasn't kidding. The great commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. Um, what aren't you telling me? There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. I won't kill for you. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> Tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. Okay, well, somebody needs to die. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Araka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Araka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Araka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. Same damn thing. I don't see the distinction. The distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Vosk needed to see you, needed to realize who he's dealing with. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to kill him. <laughs> yeah, he mentioned... That I'm going to sleep. Okay, Arya for over-talking, Shepard. Okay, what have we got back here? Uh-oh. A sabotaged Metagel dispenser. Alright. 
Hello? You have a copy of a Shepard VI? Oh, yeah. The one based on that war hero? We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version working. Oh. And there it is. Good to meet you. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Okay, thanks. Thanks for unlocking it. Okay, what else have we got? Son of a bitch. I know there's another medical Please, dispenser. I can give you the location there. You thought I was bluffing. Hit him, the Hades Nexus. If you could get past the Reaper Patrols, I'm sure you'd find something valuable. That's got to be what ah, some shit. Please, my family is starving. All right, I think we just got a quest from him. Okay, what else? Did we we check this one? We didn't. All right, that should be all of the Metagel dispensers. Head back over here to the doctor. I fixed the sabotage. The Metagel dispensers should be working now. Thank you. I'll get patients moving through triage immediately. Oh. Great work, Shepard. Uh -oh. And listen, I'm sorry for... Hey, that's him. That's my Cerberus contact. Hey, hey, you. You're under arrest. Uh-oh, this isn't going to be good. Shepard, did I help? Yeah, Conrad. You helped. I don't even feel anything. Actually, I sabotaged his gun. It oh. might have looked like it fired, Jenna. but that was just the thermal clip overheating. Hi, Commander. It's me, Jenna. You helped me a few years ago when I was working undercover at Cora's Den. And now you're volunteering here. Right. Chalik showed me a few little tricks when he had me working undercover. Guess that paid off, huh? You... you saved my life. I can't believe you were willing to lay down your life for Commander Shepard. You're so brave. Oh, the Commander and I go way back. Let me give you a hand, and I can tell you about it. Alright, so he did survive. I thought Kelly Chambers had to be alive, though, in order for him to live, but... Okay, I can go with that. Alright, so we've got some more war assets and credits. It's time to move on. That's going to be it. We just need to turn in our assignment here with the. Uh, I have your footage. His producer, whatever he is, documentary right specialist. Oh, and we've leveled up. All right, thank you. All right, we'll be going. Let's go to the Presidium Commons. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. And this is another area where we experience frame rate drops. So, yeah, here we've got... Is that? Services. It seems the Reapers took our culture when they took our yeah, world. No. See, Barla Vaughn should have been back here. And uh it's my buddy and I'm may have died, I don't know, in the in the attack. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Oh, let's get this uh, high caliber barrel. 
visit any of our Elkos Combine affiliate branches for any and all personal needs. Why should I trust them? Oh, is this our opportunity to get fish? Yes. Now that we have a chef on board or a barman on board. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times of crisis. SMG recoil system. At Canala Exports, we believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. Mm, that sounds like a decent upgrade. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times Thank of crisis. Thank you for shopping at Canala mm -hmm. Exports. Mm -hmm. Listen, I thought of something. No, it can't wait until I'm back on duty. Oh, the Hesperia boy. period. Their statues had legendarily accurate Prothean inscriptions. Can we use that? Yes, I know the Athena Nebula is off limits, but this a classified project. It needs all the Prothean intel we can find. I haven't found any reliable pictures, but just think. If those statues had something that could help us even today. Okay, we got another Looks like a quest. Yeah, I'm just gonna be nosy and make sure I get all these things. Walk slowly. Ears perked. I'm really upset that I didn't come here before. Wow, look at all the damage. Uh oh. Gnarl. Alright, let's go up here and take care of this. Spectre terminal updated. What's going on? Map is updated. Alright, well let's go on in here and see what's happening. Quick, hands behind your back. We'll be here any minute. What the hell are you talking about? Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Arya brings him the great commander Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Nero. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. <laughs> I'm going to trust you. This better be on the up and up. Quiet! Arya Talilk is even more powerful than I thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this! Commander Shepard, I want you to know. Your head will be a hood ornament on my personal shadow. Keep your distance, Creed. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? Most definitely. Arya can use Blood Pack as she sees fit. Wasn't talking to you, Creed. Quill? What? You have my word. Now open fire! Well, this was interesting. Not him. Grill's next in line to take over. Arya's deal is with him. Yes, uh, yes, I'm Arius Mo, Shepard. You scratch my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Word of advice don't double cross Arya. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Uh huh. Good work, Nerl. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. Very interesting. These were, um, in the unmodded vanilla game, they were Vorcha. And I guess they were representing the Blood Pack? But yeah, Krogan are, are, are the Blood Pack members. That was pretty cool. All of the voices don't really fit Krogan, but hey. You can't have everything, can you? All right, let's just go over here on this other side and make sure there's nothing for us. No, the Krogan are the only race uh -oh. that can fight on the toxic world, so they need support. Well, ideally, something like a cactus. They're good in mountains and use toxins, ferociously loyal to their riders. Yes, they'd be ideal. Unfortunately, they were a driven... A Cacliosaur fossil. Yeah, I don't know. Don't remember where those are. Another 
for Cerberus trap? CSEC oh, officer. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. Okay, so that was one of the things we picked up while we were traveling the galaxy. Oh, they need Citadel target jamming. All right, General Oraka. Commander Shepard. General Oraka. I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. Yes. Neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now. Reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. I'll get the weapons for you. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. All right, let's just walk through this area. Keep our ears alert. I know the Hades Nexus is off limits. I'm not an idiot. Oh, Damn Hades it, the Nexus. Needs that thing right now. The obelisk of Karza was supposed to contain Prothean language translations. Like the Rosetta Stone for Protheans. Think of how much it could have helped us understand. All right, got another quest. Wait, what? We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you, Commander. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets All right, thank you. All right, no one here to talk to. Welcome to Casa Fabrication. Oh, wow, look at all this stuff. Proceeds from all purchases go to help our men and women serving in the Alliance. Wow, power recharge, 30%. Huh. It's tempting. And damage, 30%. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Proceeds from all purchases go to help our men and women. A business in the suit. We can't. We can't see what it looks like, and it's. It looks like it's free too. Oh, it's three hundred credits. I'll buy it. Why not? Proceeds from all purchases. Piercing mod. We'll take that. have been marked down with our special wartime discount. All right, we'll go with these things. I'm kind of for the best tempted, business, though, for this Inferno armor. Proceeds hmm. from all purchases go to help our men and women serving in the Alliance. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Uh, I'm getting it. All goods have been marked there. down with our special Thank wartime you for discount. I don't know if I'll wear it, but I'm getting it. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. 
All proceeds from today's purchases go toward the Turian War effort. Oh, that's a lovely idea. I really appreciate management doing it. My husband's away on duty right now. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. Okay, let's see. High caliber barrel. Shoot smart. Take that. Shoot, Nosastra. Our selections include rare technology upgrades from the Terminus systems. Take that. Hmm, get these power magnifiers. We're running out of money. We'll take these though. Shoot smart. Shoot. Selling weapons to everyone in the Citadel. CSEC will shut this whole place down. CSEC couldn't protect us when Cerberus attacked. Mm -hmm. Would a bunch of civilians shooting at anything that moves make the Citadel safer? The commander's right. Maybe if the Council organizes a civilian militia with training. Otherwise, they'll just panic and get themselves killed. I just... I just want people to be safe. I know. But second-guessing CSEC isn't the way. Alright, so what does Agor have? Pistol okay. skill. Agor munitions for deals you never see coming. Our customer service specialists are always in sixty percent reduced damage. Who wants that? Please obey all local government restrictions when sink, purchasing though. protective equipment. Thank you for shopping at Agor We're good. Munitions. Welcome to Cipertine Armory. Aha, here is the Faiston. So I actually have to All buy Cipertine this so that um, Garrus would have it? For performance. See our extranet site for details. All right, we got it. Proceeds from all sales go to help the troops on Palavan. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. That's Cipratine. Thank you for shopping. All right, at that's good. Mechanic. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal. See? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C Sec too? Mm. I already got harassed by the old Turian with a bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. What will you take? So, what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with CSEC, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Um, okay. I don't know what rare Credits stuff you're looking me, for. CSEC wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple of artifacts. Artifacts. Alright. We'll look for them. Okay. Oh, look. It's Liara. Hello, Shepard. Hello. Well, since she's not my love interest, there's not gonna be much to talk about. Commander Shepard, do you have a minute? Yes. Can I help you? Jordan Knowles, E-Crimes. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. I've got a saboteur hacking key systems. Power, communications. It's bad. If you've got time to help, check out this console. Got it. it looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes, from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can shut them down. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the Embassy. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Okay. Anything else? We have to keep enforcing uh -oh. the law. Same as always. Without that, everything goes to hell. Everyone on the Citadel knows we're at war now. Cerberus caught CSEC by surprise last Renegade. night. Renegade? You need to make sure that never happens again. 
That's what I'm saying. Forget the small stuff. Support defense and security and take down anyone who threatens the peace. You make it sound like we're under martial law. After a coup attempt during wartime, maybe we should be. Okay, can't interact with him. So it looks like the Jonas Sedaris thing. Oh, I got to talk to Bailey first. Okay. Wait, wait. Okay, heating unit stabilizers. We got that one. Uh oh. What's going on here? I'm in position as CSEC. Draw them away, and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. Okay, now I can go talk to this man. Commander Shepard. Guess I know what happened to my backup. Excuse me? Come on. I'm in CSEC in civilian gear with a weapon. I know what I'm made. Just let me explain. Captain Aaron Summers, Alliance Marines, retired. Captain Summers? There's a prisoner here. CSEC officer who helped Cerberus. CSEC caught him when you stopped the coup. Now he's offering them intel on Cerberus to get a better deal. Why are you telling me this? Because he doesn't deserve a better deal. He killed people during the coup, good people. And he's former Alliance, like us. The way I figure it, he's our problem to fix. Hmm. Wow, we actually got the uh, Paragon and Renegade choices. I don't recall running into this until now. You're better than this. If you gun that man down, you're dishonoring the uniform just as much as he did. Like hell I am. I don't like plea bargains any more than you do, but the intel we get will save lives. Says who? Our superiors. The people we swore to serve and trust. Captain Summers. Yes, Commander. Sorry, Commander. I'll shut it down. Thanks. Captain Summers! He's gone! All right, let's go. Okay, you two. Disperse. This is over with. All right, we talked to him already. All right, we're heading back He's a terrorist. He ought to, be locked up. to the Presidium embassies Spectre status recognized please select a destination Citadel embassies one moment please now arriving at Presidium embassy What was that? There was some... I guess it was for Commander Bailey. Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? Here to talk about you releasing Jonas Sedaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the Council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. Let me see her. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the CSEC outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. Okay. Anything Let else you got? Let me know when you've had a chance to talk to Sedera's. All right. So that means, where's the controls? We are headed back to Presidium Commons. It was really hard to find these things the first few times playing the game. It really didn't 
make it clear where the CSEC outpost was. You, you just wouldn't know. Wait, something just beeped. Oh, is this a Raka again? Okay. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. But yes, this is the Citadel CSEC outpost. Who's not spying on me now? Ah, oh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. Oh, oh yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. Leave it in the past. You have to move on. And I will, once all my enemies are dead. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Sane, my second in command, is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. I'll find another solution. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Okay, now at this point I'm not sure what we need to do. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. Mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. Areas tagged of interest to you are highlighted on the elevator menu. Oh man, I don't know where where um sane is. I want to say it's the holding area. And again, you would never know, you know, where to go. Still could be going to the wrong spot. Wait, I, I did it. This is the right spot. Men, get ready for trouble. Not here for that, Sane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris' release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. You don't need Sedaris. Same. You should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. <laughs> okay. All right. Son of a bitch. Let's see. I think we can go and talk to Arya now. There's a lot of guns here, I'm noticing. Shepard, the council withdrew the release order for Sedaris. Arya Talok, of all people, got him to do it. Crazy. You can say that again. Thanks for your help, Shepard. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shepard. I don't know what to say. I'm trying to go over everything in my head. Make sense of it. Whoa. 
Why were you helping Udina? Your bandages were still fresh. How did you end up working with Udina? You saw me in the hospital. I was going crazy. Felt like I was letting everyone down. When Udina offered to make me a Spectre, I thought it was a chance to do some good. I couldn't just sit back and watch either. Yeah. But it sure turned into a mess. It shouldn't have happened. I never wanted to put you in that situation. We're on the same side. I can't believe it came to that. We were so close to... Ash, it's okay. We figured it out. We stopped Adina and got to walk away. That's the important part. I can't believe he was responsible for all of it. Was he indoctrinated? It's hard to say. How do we fight something that can worm its way into your head? I don't know. But we don't have a choice. I wanted to talk to you about that. Hackett asked me to join his team. It's a great offer, but... I'd prefer to ride this thing out aboard the Normandy. Hmm. Well, we could actually dismiss her. But I'm not. Welcome aboard. Permission granted. Couldn't do this without you. I'll grab my gear. And Ash? Yeah? It's good to have you back. Yes, sir. All right, so we now have Ashley back as part of the crew. Shepard, I got Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Odina? That SOB was always power hungry. But this? He wasn't in charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the Citadel. What the hell for? I don't know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Counselor Valorn. Kyline. What? Your assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. You know him. I take it you two have met. Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. I shot him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But he should have begun on Omega even stronger. Elusive man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson. It's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. Yes. Because he has phantom class implants. Thanks for the intel. I'll take whatever advantage I can get against these bastards. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Mm. Yes, the Asari and Solarians are both throwing in their support now. How's your progress on the Crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So quickly? Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean-specific. Hmm. Are we any closer to understanding how to use it? That's still open for debate. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is... How will it dispense the energy? And in what form? You mean, how do you stop it from wiping us all out? Exactly. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. I'll send you an update on the schematics. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. I won't fail you. You've always trusted me. I won't let you down. We're still in this. The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. Good luck, both of you. Anderson out. Commander, the Tyrian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. And the Quarians are willing to talk. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Be careful. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. Shepard, oh, do you no. have a moment? What now? A contact within Asari High Command was insistent I pass on a distress signal to you. What? Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on this? That they wouldn't ask for help if it wasn't important. The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. 
I'll try to figure out what's going on. Wow. I have got so many things to do. And I'm not sure what what is timed, what isn't. I mean, we've got side missions. We've got main missions. I mean, we still have to, to look in on the Krogan and the Rachni thing and binning. And there's just so much going on. Oh my goodness, what are we gonna do? Oh, no. Trainer, no. All right, let's, let's let these things um, tick off here. We've got lots and lots of updates. Wow, you talk about overwhelming people. I don't know what, what, what I'm going to do next. I really don't. But I do know in our next episode, it's going to be some action and some combat. This, this was a long, tedious episode with plenty of talking and going from point A to point B. And now let's hear what Trainer has to say. Commander, I found something you need to see. What have you got? A group of Cerberus scientists cut ties and fled. Perhaps they finally realized they were on the wrong side. We don't know what they were researching, but they were among the elusive man's top scientists. They could help build the Crucible. That's a good idea. Maybe we could recruit them. Lots of Cerberus people think they're doing the right thing. I know I did. And you were right, Commander. Whatever crimes Cerberus is committing now, I was on Horizon when the Collectors attacked. Really? You'll recall I mentioned growing up in the Terminus systems. I was visiting my family at home. While the Alliance was running studies, you were saving me and my family. Has the Alliance tried to make contact with the scientists? They've been unable to find them, but they're searching. As is Cerberus. I've been monitoring Cerberus communications. I've charted signal frequency from various Cerberus cells by location and cross-referenced known ship movements. You found them? There's no way to be certain, but I've got a definite possibility. Nice work. Put it on the map and I'll give it a look. It's on the map now, Commander. Thanks. All right, people. We have got so, so much to do. And we'll try to sort some of it out in our next episode. So until then, this is Hill, and I'm out.